Hello, I'm Tram, and today I'm gonna talk about my final project, Multiple Convex Polygon Intersections. Uh, my topic is to find the intersection of multiple convex polygons. This means I'll find the region where all the polygons overlap. First of all, I will plot the points for the first polygon. If it is a convex polygon, it will be added to an array of convex polygons. After being done with the first polygon, I'll press the letter N to start plotting points for the next polygon. I'll keep doing this until I'm happy with the number of my polygons. Then in order to find the intersection of all convex polygons, I'll press the letter I so that the intersection will be calculated and highlighted. The program also brings out the number of convex polygons and calculates the area of the highlighted intersection. Next, moving on to the background and application of this algorithm. A convex polygon is a simple polygon. It's also called non-self-intersecting polygon, in which no line segment between two points on the boundary ever goes outside the polygon. The intersection is a region where two or more polygons overlap. However, in this project, like I said earlier, the intersection that I need to find is the region where all the polygons overlap. This algorithm can have important applications in computer graphics, computer chip design, and targeting studies. For example, in targeting, this algorithm is useful in generating an, an um, operating area against several targets. Moving on to the algorithm. Uh, in this project, I'll implement an algorithm that is carried out in a small number of steps. The function polygon intersection will take two input, polygon 1 and polygon 2. First, I'll create an empty polygon as a P. And next, I'll add on vertices of polygon 1, that's the inside polygon 2, to P. Next, I'll do the same step, like step 2. I'll add all the vertices of polygon 2, that is inside polygon 1 to P. And next step, I'll add it on the intersection points to B. In order to find the intersection points, I can use um, the algorithm that we implemented in earlier project, that the, we find the intersection between the edges of the polygons. And the next step, we order all points in the, in the P counterclockwise. And this, already, this function return P, which is the intersection of polygon 1 and polygon 2. We continue recurse this function. However, instead of taking two polygons, polygons 1 and polygons 2, we take in the P and polygons 3, which is P is the intersection of polygons 1 and polygon 2. And polygon 3 is the next polygon. So the next function will calculate the intersection of the previous intersection and polygons 3. We keep doing this for all the polygons in the array. Uh, the time complexity is O and square. Okay, moving on to the demo. I will start plotting the points for the first polygon. If the polygon is green, this is the convex polygon. Once I done, once I'm done with the first one, I'll press the letter N to draw the next polygon. Then I can draw the next polygon. If, and I'm happy with it, I'll start. I'll press N to continue drawing the next one. Next. Okay. Next. Okay, now I'm happy with what I have and I'll press the letter I to find the intersection of all of this polygon. Now, this polygon is highlighted. This is a uh, intersection of all the polygons. I'll clear it and do another example. Okay, I'll start writing it, uh, drawing it. Uh, next. This one, for example, you see, 
this is a concave polygon so this is red and when I, when I press the letter N it wouldn't be added to the convex array it is actually removed now I'll start drawing the next one this is green or the concave polygon I press N this is added to the uh, an array because this is a convex polygon I'll start drawing the other one right here so I'm happy with it I'll start press letter N now you can see that uh, the intersection we don't we don't see any intersection in here once I press the letter I because they don't have any a region we don't have any specific region that all the polygons overlap if you look at this corner you can see that um, this will bring out the number of convex polygon and it will find the intersection area because in this case we don't have the intersection area so so the area is zero so clear it do another example again make it more complicated how about that Let's see so concave remove It will automatically remove the concave uh, polygons. So let's see. Next, try to make it more complicated. Oops. Next, okay. Looks good to me. Looks complicated to me. Okay, let's try. Let's do one more thing. Let's do one more. Okay, more complicated now and press the letter I to calculate the intersection this part and we still show the number of convex polygon is 6 and the intersection area the, is um, 10,000 more than 10,000 pixels yep that's pretty much the de my demonstration thank you